Hey y'all, don't forget to hit those buttons over there while you're listening. FBI has raided the home of the top aides to Mayor Eric Adams. Apparently, the weekly jobless claims have fallen to a two-month low. I am still jobless. Please don't forget to hit those buttons. However, Americans who have a job are feeling secure. Not so many who are looking for one. Because U.S. companies have added the fewest number of jobs since 2021. Small businesses lost 9,000 jobs. Small businesses I work for closed. While medium-sized businesses gained 68,000 and large companies added 42,000. Hmm. Trump has stated he would create a commission to audit the federal government and put Musk in charge of that. Musk would be the head of the Efficiency Commission. Dumb and dumber. Putin apparently supports Harris, loves her infectious laugh, indicates she's doing well, he says, and maybe her positive demeanor will lead her to not put so many sanctions on us. South Carolina has has passed the school cell phone ban, which in light of yesterday, I cannot imagine that feels, ugh. Speaking of, that boy was on the FBI radar last year. Of course, Jenny Thomas um, is praising the religious rights group who opposes the Supreme Court reform efforts. She and her husband have benefited tremendously, so of course... A man unalived at least 118 eagles to sell their parts on the black market. And, yeah. And uh, prosecutors are seeking significant imprisonment and a large chunk of uh, money for restitution. Scare me. Tesla says it will launch a full self-driving product in Europe and China early next year. I didn't think ours were doing so well. I don't know. I mean, I don't think we have that many, but the ones I've seen don't look like they're doing so great. World pumps out 57 million tons of plastic pollution a year. And over two-thirds of it originate from the global south. I thought for sure America was going to be the leader in that. Which maybe we are because they're looking at continents. I don't know. India is not a continent. Okay. Anyways. Verizon will be buying Frontier in a $20 billion deal to strengthen its fiber network. Apparently, Okaloosa County ain't doing so well. I used to go there every year, but it got too expensive. And then the last couple of years, we just like boycotted Florida. So, I don't know. They're trying to boost tourism, and they're like going to put in an artificial reef with this big, large boat or something. I don't know. Y'all, nearly 2,000 drug manufacturing plants are overdue since before the pandemic in FDA inspections. We saw what they just found in Boar's Head. We know how long it took them to investigate the baby formula claims, and then once they got in there, what they found. This is scare me, big time. Ugh. NASA says, oh, no need for evacuations. Small, harmless asteroid that just burned up in Earth's atmosphere over the Philippines. No worries. And it sounds like the Boeing Starliner spacecraft will attempt to return to Earth without the crew on Friday. I guess they're just going to be hanging out at the International Space Space Station until February when SpaceX is supposed to come save the day. We'll see if this thing makes it back. Weird. Of course, GOP um, lawsuits are... They're, I guess, setting the stage for state challenges if Trump loses the election. So we've got Democrats suing third-party candidates and Republicans lawsuits to, you know, because if Trump wins, he won. And if he loses, he cheated. The Alaska governor is vetoing birth control expansion, like to be able to go in and get a prescription for a year or something like that. Meanwhile, we've got a judge who just 
overturned a law saying that only doctors could perform abortions because, yay, medication abortion should be able to be prescribed via telemedicine or any other, like a nurse practitioner, whatever. Anyways, Alaska's got two opposite end of things going on. And if you are in Missouri, I do not, I read this article and I'm still confused about the wording and the language and who is saying what here. So know your wording on the Missouri ballot as all, all the others too. <sighs> Don't forget to, uh, heavy, heavy, heavy times, aren't they? My therapist said, it made me feel so validated that if you are not concerned with world events and you're not paying attention, and if you're not paying attention, you're just privileged. So I am paying attention because I can't not pay attention. I've got the future lives of, and yesterday was awful. And um, anyways, I've been reposting to amplify those voices um, and just glossed over that slide because there is other stuff um, to report. Anyways, I hope your day doesn't suck. Don't forget to hit those buttons over there. I love y'all and yeah. Okay, bye.